Hello and welcome back to another beer review me, Ruku. Today's beer review is Sierra Nevada's Tropical Little Thing. Uh, this is the Hazy IPA. Comes in at a nice 7% there from the US, so United States of America. Uh, this is a 12 fluid ounce can or a 355 and is a craft company. So they've been around for years. I love Love Sierra Nevada beers. Um, had a few bad ones, but uh, only on one hand. I was going to say about three. Three out of all of them that I've tried. Now, I've gone ahead and poured it. Um, just let the head go down because it was a bit mental. But as we can see here, the colour is sticking to its word. It is hazy. It's like a, a light, sort of milky hazy. And uh, you can actually see some sediment. If you look very, very carefully, there are chunks of sediment just here, there and everywhere, just floating around in this. And it only just caught my eye when I was really looking at it. I was making it for um, for actual carbonation, but it wasn't. It was, you know, sediment. Um, so now that's gone down. I'm just going to top myself up a tiny bit. There we go. Lovely. Right, so looks-wise, looks good. And uh, the strength is there. So uh, let's see what I can sniff out of this, first of all. So let's go with the aromas and on with that important taste test. So looking good. Right, let's crack on. Tropical notes, as you'd expect. Pear, papaya, maybe a little bit of orange rind. And just an overall fruitiness, so like a fruit salad. It smells lovely. Right, on with the taste. Cheers, guys. That's good. Okay. Oh, that's lovely. So what we got here is abundance of flavour, and it's going to be very hard to pick out what's in this. But I'm getting pineapple, papaya, pear, maybe a little bit of peach, um, some orange rind. And Joe you know what, it's actually got a tiny, tiny bit of sweetness to it. Like a sticky sweetness, and uh, that comes purely from the head. And that reminds me of a hard-boiled sweet that's, uh, you know, when you get it around your lips and it, it goes sticky, and it's that sweet stickiness. That's kind of how this feels. And uh, I like that. It's nice. The alcohol you can get uh, just on the finish, but uh, initially it's a very gentle beer, very smooth, easygoing. You, know, you can feel the haziness in the mouth it feels sort of not heavy but getting towards heavy so a light heavy in the mouth um tropical flavors and i don't know quite what they are uh, as i said before but i'm definitely getting pineapple peach maybe pear um some sort of orange or or, or something like that something rind uh, and, and then i think maybe some mango in there and I'll tell you what though, it's really juicy, it's sticking to its word, there's a juiciness about it. It really is a cracking beer. And um, as I say, the alcohol comes at the end there. So once all the fruit's gotten out of the way, you do get a brief amount of hops there. And then the alcohol hit, and then uh, just back to that fruitiness, so very, very pleasurable indeed. Um, I love it. I love it. I'm glad uh, I chose this. And for some reason, the Tropical Little Thing series never seems to disappoint me. I've had most of them, and they're always producing good results. So, uh, love Sierra Nevada, and uh, another great American beer and a great example of one. And I will score this a. Do you know what? It's tough. I, do you know what? I, I'm going to call it a 9 out of 10. I'm going to go over 9. I was going to go at 8.5, but I'm going to push it, and I'm going to say a 9. So there you go, 9 out of 10 for me uh, on this tropical little thing, hazy little thing IPA from Sierra Nevada from America. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and also tell your friends about this channel. I dare you to. Get them subscribing too. Who knows? They might love their beer just like I do. Till next time, guys. 
Thanks for watching.